If I have to describe Japan in a word, I would say balance. Probably unique. I think it'll be harmony. The chair's mission is to undertake research into Japan's uh, foreign policy and security policy uh, primarily. We look at how Japan's foreign and security policy is evolving, uh, and this is really important now because the, the speed of evolution of, uh, of Japanese security policy is, has really picked up, uh, particularly since uh, China became more assertive. Uh, but we also look at how Japan is innovating in terms of its economic statecraft, where, where Japan's been, I think, very innovative. I think there are several things about Japan that is often misunderstood. One is that Japan has played a proactive role in, in, in maintaining the real space order and peace and security and prosperity in the Indo-Pacific region and more globally recently. But also the second point is that Japan has been an innovative thought leader. In all sense, Japan is very unique. Japan is grouped as the West but very different from the Western countries. Um, and taking that into account in any ana analysis is, uh, or conducting project is critically important. Japan um, is on the front line of strategic competition with China. Um, Japan also is in a difficult neighborhood. Uh, it has uh, Russia in the north, it has North Korea in the middle, and China in the south. So it has uh, territorial disputes with all, with all its neighbors. Japan's concept of, uh, of threat, I think, is, uh, is being called panoramic. And I think for those reasons, uh, other countries that are also trying to come to terms with you know, larger powers that are, that are trying to change the status quo, Japan has a, has a, has a unique voice uh, and can tell us a lot about how to try and deal with these, uh, these threats. The role of Japan is changing right now. It is shifting its role in the international community to a bigger role politically, economically, historically, culturally. Japan is in a very unique position which can connect the region and the Western allies. We have offices in Washington DC, Singapore, Berlin, and Manama. So we have experts across the region to work together for, uh, to, to answer pressing policy challenges together and contextualize Japan in the larger kind of global context. Well, Japan is an indispensable actor in the Indo-Pacific now and, and re with relations in Europe de deepening with the UK, with Germany, other countries. So we hope to shed light on, on why that is the case and what is going on. We also hope to shed light on the, um, the innovation that Japan is, is uh, undertaking in policy terms particularly around areas uh, in a sort of broader definition of security, such as economic security, uh, for example. This is important because we hope that we can, through our work, we can also um, shed light for, for other governments, particularly those in Europe, on what Japan is doing, and perhaps they can draw some lessons for their own policy uh, making uh, as a result of that.